have noticed also, when you guys are actually teaching your Xactimate classes, uh, we always do, of course, a pre-mitigation scan, but I've seen you guys use post-mitigation scans. What are those for? Yeah, so when you're an estimator or an adjuster and you're trying to scope a loss, uh, it's really important to have both pre-mit and post-mit scans. Pre-mitigation, so you know exactly what the house looked like at the time of the loss. When everything's a little flooded, you know exactly what the house looked like. Post-mitigation is after all the demo and damage has been done by the contractor mitigating the, 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 the claim, uh, it's important to have that post-mitigation scan so you know exactly what it looked like, what was done, so you can estimate what it takes to put it all back together. Very cool. Another cool use to it. Yeah, one thing I just noticed is that this camera's moving a little bit faster right now. Yeah, so brand new camera that we received from Matterport. We hadn't even turned it on before we did this video. Um, there's actually an update that they recently put forth where it actually allows you to scan much quicker. Um, we updated it in between shoots. Ready to go, as you saw, spun around much quicker. Thank you, Matterport, for that. Uh, very helpful in moving through losses quicker. And if you guys like to see more of these pre-mitigation and post-mitigation scans, um, I'll make sure that the link for Actionable Insights 3D tours are available so that you guys can check them out and see what the final products of these scans look like.